All right, guys, how you doing? It's Rubia. I hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed that little tune at the start of this video, aptly named Go Time. If you like that tune and you wanted me to put that on streaming platforms, please do let me know in the comment section below. A few weeks ago, my good friend Matt Knight from Boss came to visit the studio to hang out, catch up and everything. And he brought with him a new product that Boss are launching. In fact, launching it on the day of this video as well. And he was like, I'm not sure if this is your thing, but I thought it might be quite cool backstage when you're you know, a gig when you're warming up and that kind of thing, if you want to check it out. And he handed me this little thing. So this is the Katana Go. And what he said is basically a fully functioning, fully working Katana. So like the amplifiers that you've got, the 50 watt, 100 watt, 212 version. Everything that you see in that amp that's packed into that is also packed into this tiny little box with a jack plug on the end. You shove in your guitar and you can use it. All the effects, all the stomps, all the amps, all of that stuff is actually in this little thing. He said this is actually more powerful than the amplifier versions. It has a headphone out, has stage feel in it. So if you've used the Wazza headphones and they've got that whole stage feel thing going on, that's also in this. So when you plug in your headphones in, you feel like you're in a inner space with the amps and everything like that. It has a built-in tuner, it's Bluetooth, has a USB-C charger on it. The Bluetooth connects to your phone so you can control the entirety of this thing with your phone. There's an app for it with an editor so you can make all your tones in that, save them to banks. Um, and there's loads of different banks and presets listed so you can just save as many tones as you feel like. He also pointed out that the headphone out on this is a high, high class recording out. So the tune you just heard, all the guitar tones and everything came from this. Literally, I plugged in a headphone cable uh, into here and then that came out into my interface and I just recorded all the guitars with that. So I thought it was pretty impressive and never. I was slightly dubious when I thought, oh, I wonder if I could actually make a tune with this thing because uh, I'm used to using other stuff, you know, like amps and plugins or whatever. Um, whereas this was <laughs> super simple and you've got your phone out and you're just like, oh, I feel like I want a lead tone for this and you're just flicking through your phone, dial it in. I'm really happy with the sounds I got on the song. Um, I just thought that was really cool. This isn't a sponsored video or anything. I just wanted to add this message on the back end because having done that tune, I was like, I am actually pretty impressed with this little thing. It's pretty cool. So you can get hold of one of these if you want. I will uh, link it in the description box below. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the tones and the sounds uh, from this little beast in this video. Thank you to Matt for coming down and introducing me to this thing. I will certainly be using this to warm up backstage at gigs in the future. Uh, just because of how compact it is, I can travel anywhere with it. And I've got tones and saved presets from that song in this thing. Uh, but anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. I've been Rubia. Like, subscribe and share. Links in the description box. And I'll see you all very soon.